I am Juan Faller Climaco. I was born 1859. I came from one of the wealthiest families of Cebu during the late Spanish period. I served the capital municipal of Toledo in the year of 1880s and 1890s, where my family owned huge land holdings. I am married to Maria Regina Ramos before the Philippine Revolution against the Spaniards. I was popularly called are the brain of resistance. I was raised by my parents, namely Don Bernabe Climaco and Doña Florentina Faller. I had two siblings, namely Alerjano Climaco and Arsenio Climaco with my marriage to Maria Regina Ramos Climaco. We have been blessed by two sons, Bernabe Climaco and one another child. My involvement with the KKK was hazy during the revolution against Spain. But I was able to emerge as a well-known figure when the Spaniards departed when the Filipino-American War broke out in Luzon. Luis Flores appointed me as a chief or staff. In charge of the war preparation, I together with Maxilam refused to surrender Cebu to the Americans when some provincial leaders decided to set up their own headquarters. In El Pardo, however, they later moved into Soldon with the realize they could not openly deal with superiors American training and arms after months of guerrilla warfare. I so called the brains of the resistance surrendered to the Americans on September 26, 1901. Less than a year later, I ran for governor of the province against Julio Florente and Hanley won and was sworn into office in March 1802, this one Climaco, the former governor in the province of Cebu.